Some shit happened to me when I was a kid and I thought, you know what, that's never happening to me again. Let me just make dough and live like a king. Seeing my mum upset not being able to afford to pay bills. Seeing rich arm robbers in the 90s fucking flying about in big drop top whips. Kept me motivated. You know what I learned though when I made money? Money ain't everything. In Liverpool I learned to bury money, that's a mad town. I remember being sat there and being told about a man that used to bury his money and he used to do it by footsteps. So he'd walk onto the park, he'd do a hundred footsteps forward and then fifty footsteps to the left and then a hundred footsteps over forward again and then, you know, and eventually he'd find his way to his destination. I heard that story when I was about... When I was about... About 17 by 19 shit's buried see that's what i'm on about when i say rule number five turn your pain into drive some shit happened to me when i was a kid and i thought you know what that's never happening to me again let me just make dough and live like a king yeah truth be told i've already kind of started writing something but i'm busy man a little bit too busy right now money Fucking dumb. Seeing my mum upset not being able to afford to pay bills. Seeing rich arm robbers in the 90s fucking flying about in big drop top whips. Kept me motivated. You know what I learned though when I made money? Money ain't everything. Money is only a part of success. Shut that one up. Can you be successful without GCSEs? You can. Yeah. Although I would get them if I had the chance. But flipping, you know, I still made a fair few quid to do to like youngsters and that that are following me that are doing GCSEs. But would that make you about 15, 16? I would definitely smash them to bits if I was you, just because I'm, I'm a businessman. Yeah. And like, I still have to learn shit and I still have to have structure and I still have to turn up to places on time. And going through the process of getting your GCSEs will help you. If you drop out of that early, you're not going to be used to being told what to do or having a job or build climbing your way up the ladder. Trust me, there's, there's a lot to this shit. So if I was you, I'd just get them under your belt while you still got the chance. Ah, oh, you mad man. This is off one of my supporters that messaged me saying I'm in Mexico when I was in Mexico. Come and link up and I went and linked up with him. We had a drink, we had a sick night. You're a mad man. Anyway guys, that's the end of question time and I'll speak to you soon, yeah?